Son las 5 de la mañana. It is like 40 degrees and windy. It is cold. Normally, I wake up at this time to go to the gym. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Bienvenido para atrás. Son las 5 de la mañana. Está frío. I'm about to hit the road. We picked up a new sponsor. We're excited. I got the call and they say you gotta come and get them. I'm in a crunch time with the, with the truck I'm building and I have to go get them. And I had to get up this early because they open up at 8 o'clock and I want to be there by the time they open. So we're going to hit the road. We're going to go uh, check out our new sponsors and check out what we're going to go pick up. Y otra vez, thank you guys for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Drop a comment. Let's get this video rolling. Pero por ahorita, let's do some diesel on this truck. We just got here to the destination. Acabamos de llegar. Está bien frío. Y les voy a enseñar dónde estamos. Check it out. Turn on this one. JTX headquarters, we came to pick up a set of wheels for 50 to 1. We're gonna talk to my boy Chris. Me and Chris had been uh, talking since uh, SEMA. Finally made it happen. He's like, come get, come pick up your wheels. So we're here at the factory. Hopefully they'll give us a tour of the company. Estuve platicando con Chris desde SEMA, que a lo mejor se hacía unos rines para la 50 to 1. Y todo ese tiempo estuvimos platicando que sí, que no, y que cuál estilo y la madre. Se hizo, se llegó la fecha y dijo, Déjate caer para acá para la compañía, para que levante los rines y para que le cheque la compañía. So, vamos a pasarle para adentro. Good morning, good morning. Good morning. Man, look at all this merch and stuff. How are you? Pretty good. You good? Yeah, I was uh, just telling people that uh, me and you were talking about maybe doing something since SEMA. We, mm -hmm. we started a little chit-chatting about this truck and the time went by and, and the, the, the build was getting closer and closer. And we are two weeks away from LST and we are crunching. And this is what we're picking up today is part of the crunch time. Because today is like the last day that my boy has to, to do the cut axle. The, cut yeah. the axle, get, the, get okay. everything done. You guys made it happen and we're here. So can we take a little quick tour of the facility or what's so, yeah, we'll look around, see what's going on. But first, why don't you tell people how long has this company, when did you start? So, as far as like off-road, the truck wheels. Yeah, you uh, started with off-road. That, that was the, the, that's what came well, out of the, the game, lifted, like boom. The lifted truck wheels, uh, we started those about 2019, uh, selling retail to customers in 2019. 2019. So, now here we are, fast forward. And you guys started right here at this facility or? This you guys... facility was 2020. 2020. February 2020, or, well, no, excuse me, November 2020. November 2020. Got our first wheels in here. Yep. So what made you guys say, you know what, we're, we got, you know, we're getting this uh, lifted game mm -hmm. on lockdown. What about if we do drop tr drop trucks? Well, what, how did that happen? Man, I mean, uh, so many of you guys uh, like the enthusiasts, you know? Yeah. You're seeing trailer after trailer pull up. It's got a lower truck, it's got a lifted truck on it. Yeah. You know, these guys got yeah. everything. And I'm like, man, I'm on that lifted truck, but not on that lower yeah. truck. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I'm on their tow pigs, you know? Oh, yeah, their, yeah. Got dually wheels on the tow pigs. Yeah. It's like, man, that would be cool to see all of it. Yeah. You know? Um, trucks, anything truck. We're cutting wheels for anything truck. Anything truck. From what's Lowered, the smallest? Lifted. What, 17s, 18s? Uh, or you're not going that, that small yet, 20s? 20s right now. 20s up to? 30s. 30s. 20 all the way to 30. And uh, with, what are you guys doing? 30 by 16, both. Um, we got a 30 by 16 available for the lower trucks too, for those that aren't scared. Uh, tire wise, not really any tire out there yet for that, but never know. I heard JTX had the most expensive wheels out at SEMA this year, is that true? Yes, gold? this year that, that full gold set. That gold plated set. engraved, I mean, beautiful work by Artisan on that set. Uh, man, it was just a beautiful set of wheels. I sat there and stared at it for a while. That when I heard that, I was like, it can't be. And then I walked up to that truck and I was like, Whoa. It can be. Yeah. It can be, it, it can, can be. be. It's a truck that was built by uh, Tweety's Tires. Salud para Tweety, allá este, in Midland. And what's, what was the name of the owners? Or what, what was the name of the truck? I don't know, it was a red one with all kinds of yeah. gold on it. Yeah. It was just like an eye catcher, like eye candy for everybody. I think everybody was walking around that truck. But you also got, you guys had a, a bunch of trucks out there at SEMA, crazy looking wheels. One of the trucks that caught my eye also was uh, the truck from On The Gas. Those wheels are beautiful. I was just like, whoa. Yeah, yeah. That, that set was a uh, brush center, polish center, two-tone, you know, uh, 30 by nine, 30 by 12 set on that truck. It looked good. Well, Chris, if anybody's watching this video and they're like, you know what? I want to set a fucking JTX. Is how, how can they reach you? How call you directly? Can they message you? Okay. DM you? How does how does that work? Easiest way. Website www.jtxforge.com. We have a dealer locator on there with a lot of our dealers. All listed on their phone numbers, emails for them. We're not direct to public, but we are direct to dealer. Those dealers can help you out. We built an extensive dealer network to get everybody taken yeah, yeah, care yeah, yeah, of. Yeah. Pretty much anywhere you live, there's a dealer close by. Should be somebody in your area. If there's not, you definitely can send us a message on that on that webpage. We have an email inquiry on there that goes straight to us. 
our sales guys handle it, get those filled out, get those back to you, and uh, let you know where to go to get them. Let's go check out the facility. Let's, let's, check, it let's go check it out. Yeah. Let's go. Damn it, boy. So this is where the magic happens. This is where the fat ass wheels come out. So I see you got several machines. Every machine is putting a, uh, like a, a wheel right now. Damn it, and, it, and I can hear they're all going. Yeah. So how many of these machines do you guys got already? 15. 15. That's why the turnaround time is pretty quick. <laughs> how many guys you got working at in the facility to make cutting these wheels? Just here in the machine shop, there's about 10 guys. And then we'll go back and see some other stuff where there's another 10 here, 10, yeah. Really? Yeah. All this on this side, center cap. So everybody got their, their section, what, they, what they're experts at and what they're doing. Mm -hmm. So this guy, out of that, he's cutting. Rear, rear dually caps right there rear on that pallet. Yep. Nice, nice, nice. So you guys make the floating ones here as well, in-house? In yeah. He'll get that material in there, it'll get spun down to where it. So it starts like this, it ends up like that. And then goes into these other mills. You guys are bringing uh, state-of-the-art machines. Everything looks like it's like, you know, the newest it's of the newest. It's ready to go, yes. Nice. The guys clean every day, every shift. Oh, it looks spotless in here. It looks, yeah. it looks beautiful. It looks like a very good, clean working environment. Yeah, it's crazy. I've, I've, I've gone to other shops. All the, all you, the little chips. And you just see trash and stuff everywhere. You're tripping over stuff. Right here, it's very clean, yeah. very professional. It gets nasty. Hey, so, back here. so what did you say? On this, on this side of the door, what happened? It gets after, nasty. This, after this side of the door, oh. we get, we get, we get down back here. We get down. Oh shit! Damn it, boy! I see everybody. In here. <laughs> Hell yeah, man! Everybody's messed up. Look, they're all polishing the wood. This is where everything gets polished. All the finishing. All the different finishing. This that is all have. the finishing. Like uh, that room there is polish, brush, they're doing that in there. Polish That's, and brush in there. Yeah. And over Final here. polishing here, the cleanup, the, before they get sh go to shipping, they're getting cleaned up and nice up right here. So are you guys not doing any of the uh, powder coating yet? Not yet. Are you guys gonna get into that yeah. for people? Cause you know, yeah. it's, a, it's a high demand no, that they no, want to no. match. We have plenty of sets. We have powder coaters we work with on everything. Uh, all that, that's no problem, but we will have powder coating in house before the end of this year. Yeah. So everybody needs powder coating, but they all really going to make. Yep. Look at these, we already have powder coating on them. Look at this one. Nice. Yeah. Check it out. Look at that. They got it good over here with music and everything. Yeah, you can't hear music over there. Say what's up to the camera. Aquí le quiero mandar un saludo. Saludo a la gente de East Texas. East Texas? Puro JT Exa. Ah, puro JT Exa. Y por todos lados. Y por todos lados, por todos lados. Ya se la saben. Ya nos hicimos parte de la familia JT Exa. ¿Cómo ven? Todo. Entonces, lo que ustedes están haciendo, ¿qué es aquí? Final inspection or what? Nice, nice, nice. Like you, you got like a check off list and stuff like that. So check it out. He just, he just signaled. These are the wheels that are gonna go on 50 to one. Check it out. Hey, so this one already is already being inspected. Ya pas, ya pasó la prueba. Ah, todo no, todo está esperando que pase la prueba. So what do you guys think about those? 50, 50 to one is definitely gonna look different with the big old brakes and the blue. Oh man, it's gonna look sick. We might add a little bit of color to this one. I'm not really sure yet. 
I think it, it looks beautiful just the way it is, and that truck is gonna change dramatically. It's gonna go from a set that was put on that truck maybe about 10 years ago to, you know, up to date, JTX, Lo Más Nuevo, Por Todos Lados. Hell yeah, nice. All right, Chris, so once, once they finish their inspection, and I see already there's, there's boxed over here. Mm -hmm. This is where they get boxed. They, this is where they get boxed. They get wrapped. Palleted, wrapped, and everything ready to go. Yes, sir. They find they find uh, their place that they're going to. They get stickered. They get shipped. Yep. This is it. And then it rolls onto the racks. And then that facility. And it looks so, like you guys are, are pretty, pretty pretty soon outgrowing this place. All those are easy boxes in the middle. Those are all the wheels that are going on right now. You know, like yeah. everything is getting, you know, all that stuff goes in these boxes that are in the middle. And then everything on the racks is full. Cool. Crazy. Hey, Chris, did you guys ever think you guys get, would get to this level? Or did you guys say, ah, we're, we're gonna try it and see what happens? Or was it like, we're gonna, we're gonna do it and we're gonna go hard? Man, it was a it was a consistent push the whole time. And then um, the, the greatest thing is uh, keep on. Like, the more we push, the more products we get, the more machines we put in here, the yeah. more people we put yeah. in here. Just keep, keep growing, keep yeah. growing, keep growing. Um, like adding the two-piece billet to the lineup. Yeah that creates more wheels per week, you know, sets sold per week. So we just had to keep adding and adding and adding. We have another addition coming up right now too. Awesome. We're gonna blow the back walls out and go, you know? Yeah. <laughs> you gotta put powder coating somewhere. Oh yeah, somewhere. Yeah. Ver, mijón, este ya es el, el de atrás, ¿verdad? Mira. So it's on the rear. Papantla. Damn, nice, nice, nice. No, pinche trocas, a ver. Mi mamá, no los pinches frenotes que tiene aquí. Con las windows así se le van a notar con madre. Hasta el, el, el color más ahí para la... Yeah, pinche color. El azulito se va a mirar claro. Yeah, nice, nice, nice. Toque final, el floater, mira. Que dé vueltas. Que hagas penes, ¿verdad? Jajaja. <risa> ¿Cuánto tiempo tienes ya trabajando aquí en la compañía? Ya voy para el año, pa. ¿O sí? ¿Cómo te gusta aquí? Nah, pues madre. Yeah. Yo empecé allá, Fales y también. ¿O sí? ¿Ya te brincaste para este lado? Me extraño un poco. Si hace, si hace uno verga acá, ¿no? Es todo, <risa> <con> madre. <risa> Aquí cuando chingados van a aburrir. Ya nomás estamos esperando one more wheel, que acaban el polish, and then we're gonna load them up. Pura música buena aquí. So mira, ahorita lo que van a hacer, le van a dar, ese ya es el, el the final rim that's coming out from Polish. Ese vato que está ahí es el que lo polishó y este compa es el que lo va, le va a dar la última revisada para asegurarse que todo esté bien. So se va de mano en mano en mano hasta que quedan al puro, al puro chingadazo. El the final wheel ya si queda bien ese, fuga para 610 wheeling tires. They're ready to go in the box. JTA Forge 4, la 50 to 1, 24s by 8 and a half I think it is or 9 and then the rear is 26 by 12. Y aquí anda con toda la belicada de TTX, los bélicos. We need to have it done. This weekend or next? Next. Por eso, por eso we need to, we need, we needed them to get them to uh, Precision Works para que pueda poner las llantas y hacer las medidas y hacer el corte. Porque Chris le quería dar las medidas, pero me dice, no es igual, güey, tener los rines con llantas, güey. Yeah. Dice, I need that. Pero mira, ya, está, ya están ahí arriba, so we're ready to go. All right, man. All right, Chris, we, we're, we're here and we're loaded. We're locked and loaded. We got to head back to Houston. It was, it was so badass to come out and pick them up myself and check out the, the, the facility. I got to meet a lot of the guys um, and hang out with them and seeing the work they do back in the back it, it, you know it, it they do a lot it's like i thought it was just put the wheels together and that was it but they it goes through different inspections to get it to where they they're ready to be shipped out it's crazy uh, un saludo para todos los que trabajan allá atrás que los conocí ahorita and i already told them they better stop at my booth at lsc so i can get them some scarface mix some beers some merch they were all like you everybody. didn't bring scarface mix i was like man I, you know what pull up on lsc i, I got you guys covered uh chris i will see you at lst and i'll bring that truck and it's going to be parked at your booth all the way low on the floor and you guys are going to get to check it out and make sure you guys give them a follow check out their page check out what they do because they do some nice stuff got anything to say to to the viewers well, we're good man i just can't wait to see them on the truck so oh that truck is gonna look appreciate y'all and look crazy. forward uh, to y'all seeing this truck done too all right peace Thanks. and we're out
Alright, so it's time to head back. Y de aquí nos vamos derechito para 610 Wheeling Tires. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for subscribing. Uh, make sure you guys check out JTX. Porque ya nos vamos nosotros. Fuga. Alrighty, alrighty. Andamos en Taylor, Texas, allá con los compas de JTX Forge Wheels. Y ahorita vamos llegando con los compas de 610 Wheeling Tires por todos up, lados. Como ven, vienen unos JTX mamalones. Y traemos un crunch time. So ahorita lo que vamos a hacer, le vamos a poner llantas nomás a los de atrás. Pues mira, acaban de llegar los rines de enfrente para quitarle las llantas. Pero eso, si, si, si no hay tiempo, ahorita lo que importa son los de atrás porque ahí se los van a llevar. ¿Cuál es la otra para llevar ahí? Sí, esos van para allá para el shop donde necesitan los rines y las llantas. Y luego aquellos que están allá, eso me los voy a llevar yo ahorita. Los que tienen llantas, hay que quitarle esas llantas y ponerle una más bajita. Sí. Y luego, pues si no hay tiempo hoy, los que están allá, los dejamos y dejamos los de enfrente. Y ya se pueden hacer mañana o otra cosa. I don't know how much time you guys have. What time you guys close today? Yeah, six. So we got what? Uh, two hours? An hour? Yeah. Ah, la mejor sí. Entonces la mejor sí se hace. Vamos llegando y otros compas de los 610 de volada, de volada. Es que el compadre Víctor ya les había dicho, hey, ahí va para allá el compa Scarface. So o, lo que pasó con estas, que está muy alta y está muy ancha, y cuando baja la troca, pégalo. Le, so, necesitamos, necesitamos un poquito más de espacio y menos ancha también. Pero Víctor ya había dejado esas apartadas, ¿no? Yo yeah, que las había ordenado. Esas son. Esas son, esas me las tengo que llevar yo. Los rines con llantas. Y luego irá, aquellos van a ser los buenos. Pero para todos nos voy a cargar un loro álbum. Ok. Estas llantas les, les metí como 5 millas. O están nuevecitas, por eso las vamos a poner a los, a los JTX que vienen, los nuevecitos. The ones that are there. The ones on the box, yeah. Van a decir los, los Six Table Tire Boys a ver qué les parecen los, los rinzones estos. Me van a decir si han visto un rin tan más perrón como este. Yeah, Look at that. What do you guys think? ¿Cómo ves? Nice. Mamalona de los JTX, okay. Pinche JTX, mira. Woo! That bitch is nice. Nuevecitos para para la, la troca que estamos arreglando That's con la Precision Fab. So, los rines que traje son los que tenía originalmente. Uh, y es, es, esta compañía vio, nos, nos miró que estamos trabajando en esta troca y que nos ofrecen, hey, no le podemos poner unos rines de nosotros en tu camioneta. Dije, ¿cómo no? Que se haga la machaca. Saludos para Chris and all the JTX. Is this is, this is, this is show? Eh, well, it's, it's, Or it's, are you going to drive it? I'm going to drive it. Y la, pero la troca va, 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 va a ir a varios shows este año. Ya pero la voy a manejar. Sí, el balanceo. Y esta va a ser la llantita, mira nomás. Chulada, una Lexani. Lexani, porque también estas son Lexani, parece. A ver, ¿dónde dice? Ah, sí, las van a ser de la misma, de la misma marca. ¡Eh! Hey, es la misma marca y el mismo rodado, mira. Oh, el mito rodado. Sí, sí. Oh, look good. Eh, ya. Si le echaste esa. Uh... Para que afloje, afloje Es que mira, fue el peso, este peso era, fue el peso, fue cuando, que bajó de volada. Man, a ver si no queda. Once you see that relief right there, we're going down. Eh, a ver si no queda muy stretch, no creo que quede muy stretch, no. Whenever that shit goes down like that, man, that shit makes you. Pero todavía le falta todo. Makes your heart feel, makes your heart feel a lot better. Oh yeah, that's good. Pero ese, pero sí, mira, sí le echaron un chingo de KY. Y se resbaló de volar y loco la pel. El puncho que les ayudé a darle yo. Nice, 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 nice. Esto lo metiste solo. Aquí está, KY. KY4DW40. Para tu hoyo. 
Ya están haciendo el balance acá. Quick Look Balance para que queden con madre. Bueno, pues estos días se van con el compa Tiny. Vamos a poner un poquito de prote protección aquí. Ahora we gotta take care of the other ones. JTX por todos lados on that one. Y con eso se termina este video. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for subscribing. Muchas gracias. Nos levantamos a las 5 de la mañana. Ya son las 5 de la tarde. Tenemos 12 horas ya en chingas. Pero muchas gracias. Un saludo para los compas de Six and One Tires que de volar se aventaron los rines. Thank you guys. Six and One Tires, JTX por todos lados.